Assalamu alaikum my dear students. How are you? I think you are all well by the grace of Almighty Allah. Welcome to NIEVS Home School. I am Muhammad Ali Amin Opu, an assistant teacher of mathematics, National Ideal English Version School Morning Shift. Today I am going to take a higher mathematics class for the student of class 9. Our today's topic is exercise 1.1 question number 19 that means only one question we will solve today from your book page number 22. But it means our lecture number is 11 and you have a homework, your homework number is 8. Now, my dear students, let us start our class. This is your question from your book page number 22. The question number is 19. In the following Venn diagram, U is a set of A union B union C and number of element of U is equal to 50. That means the element number of the set U is 50. And this is our diagram. The set A is this circle, the B is this circle, and the upper circle is set C. Okay? But students, activity 1 is find the value of x from this given figure and from the information we need to find out the value of x. And number 2 is find the value of n of B intersection C prime. That means we need to find out the number of element of B intersection C prime and the number of element of A prime intersection B. Okay. Activity C is find the value of number of element of A intersection B intersection C prime. First of all, we need to find out the value of x, my dear students, the activity 1. Okay. In activity 1, the value of x, how to identify? Look, in the figure, we have the set A, the set B and the set C. There are some disjoint sets. Look, my dear students, this portion only, only this portion. Look at the board very carefully. I am using red this portion only okay from this upper portion this is a set and this set is disjoint to these two okay this is another disjoint set this is another disjoint set this is another disjoint set okay this set is another disjoint this is another this is another now how many disjoint sets are there there are one two three four five six seven there are seven disjoint set here okay in a b and c union when we do the union set a b c then we should find out this seven disjoint set okay and the number of element of the number of element of a union b union c will be this addition of seven set the addition of this seven disjoint set that means my dear students look solution of one of number 19 will be what the given that given that u is equal to a union b union c okay and we need to find out the value of x okay so a union b union c is this set of u and number of element of u number of element of u equal to 50 is given but my dear students number of element of u means what u equal to this set right therefore number of element of u equal to number of element of a union b union c right number of element of u equal to number of element of a union b union c because u equal to given a union b union c that's why you can write down this one easily now my dear students from the diagram look from the diagram a union b union c is number of element of a union b union c equal to how much equal to all the disjoint sets addition that means there are seven disjoint set i told you before that there are seven disjoint sets and number of element of a union b union c will be the addition of these seven disjoint sets that means we can write down therefore implies that number of element of u is given 50 we have the 50 here that's equal to number of element of a union b union c equal to the addition of the seven disjoint sets that means the seven disjoint sets are x plus 5 plus this 2 plus 3 plus 0 plus twice x plus x plus 1 x plus 1 and the last one is x minus 1 plus x minus 1 this 7 disjoint set we need to add to find out the number of element of a union b union c okay now the next step is this is a simple calculation to solve the value of x we need to 
uh, <coughs> calculate this simple one. Okay, it's a simple calculation, my students. It's 50 remain unchanged. In the right side, we have some x, x, this twice x, this x, and this x. This x makes how many x here? Twice x, thrice x, four x, five x. That means when we add this x, we will get five x, my dear students. Now look, which the constant term has plus sign before? We should add that one. 5 has plus sign, 2 has plus sign, 5 and 2 make 7, 7, 3 has plus sign, so we should add this also, 7 and 3 makes 10, okay, 10 and 0 has plus sign, 10 and 0 makes again 10, okay, this 10 plus 1 is addition sign also, so 10 plus 1 equal to 11, this one has negative sign, so we can't add this one, so we find out 5 plus 2, 7, 7 plus 3 equal to 10, 10 plus 0 equal to 10, and 10 plus 1 equal to 11 so plus 11 we should write down okay and minus 1 is also remain here minus 1 now my dear students it is very simple it's 50 remain unchanged it's 5x also remain unchanged now 11 minus 1 equal to how much equal to 10 okay now we need to omit this 10 from the right side okay to omit this 10 from the right side we should subtract 10 from the both side okay 50 minus 10 that's equal to 5x plus 10 minus 10 now we'll get how much we'll get 50 minus 10 equal to 40 that's equal to 5x now we already omit this 10 from the right side okay we have only 5x equal to 40 that means we can write it down also 5x in the left, left side 5x equal to 40 my dear students okay now we need to omit we have no space below so we should omit this 5 from here to calculate the value of x to identify the value of x we need to omit this 5 to omit this 5 we must divide both side by 5 okay so divide both side by 5 it's 5x divided by 5 that's equal to 40 divided by 5 40 divided by 5 we need to omit the 5 that is why we divide both side by 5 now my dear students it will be very easy now 5 will be omitted it is in the left side remain x and the right side when you divide 40 by 5 will get 8 that means the value of x equal to nothing but 8 this is our answer of activity 1 okay now we'll solve the activity 2 my dear students the activity 2 will solve find the value of find the value of number of element of b intersection c prime we need to find out the value of number of element of b intersection c prime first of all we need to find out this one b intersection c prime before that we must find out the c prime what is c prime here my dear students c is this circle okay look very carefully c is this circle right and c prime equal to what c prime equal to without outer this circle inner circle is c okay and outer portion of this outer set of this set is called c prime or c complement that means c complements contain twice x x plus 1 and x minus 1 right and we need to intersect with these three we need to intersect with these three the set b the c set b contains this four it is joint set that means 0 3 x plus 1 x minus 1 and intersection is means the common part the common element now my dear students b has the set this one 0 3 x plus 1 and x minus 1 b has this four disjoint set and c complement has this three disjoint set between this three and this four we'll find out x plus 1 and x minus 1 is belong to b intersection c complement i repeat x plus 1 and x minus 1 is belong to b intersection c complement i hope you have understood now number of element of b intersection c complement equal to how much number of element of b intersection c equal to nothing but x plus 1 plus x minus 1 that means addition of these two disjoint set now we can solve this one my dear students the activity 2 to solve activity 2 i am erasing activity 1 okay my 
my dear students it's solution of activity 2 now we can write down from the figure from the figure or you can write down from the given figure okay number of element of b intersection c complement is equal to addition of these two disjoint set x plus 1 plus x minus 1 x plus 1 plus x minus 1 so it is how much 1 and 1 will be omitted plus 1 and minus 1 will be omitted so x plus x equal to twice x my dear students and we know the value of x equal to how much x equal to 8 from 1 okay so x to a 2 multiplication with 8 okay twice x equal to 2 multiplication with 8 from you can write down a note therefore <coughs> x equal to 8 from 1 from 1 we can get x equal to 8 and put this value of x here now 2 multiplication with 8 equal to how much equal to 16 that means the number of element of b intersection c complement equal to 16 okay and another one is we need to find out number of element of a prime intersection b my dear students number of element of again again from the figure from the figure from the figure number of element of a prime intersection b we need to calculate my dear students look at the board very carefully it is very important to understand which disjoint sets are indicate a prime intersection b look the set a this is the set a i am using the different color here okay this is the set a and what is the identification of a prime we need to find out a prime a prime is the outer part of this set a that means a prime contains the element x plus 5 0 and x minus 1 this three set contains in a prime okay we need to intersect with this three disjoint set we need to intersect the set b the set b contains which sets the set b contains 0 3 x plus 1 and x minus 1 this four set contains in b and a intersection contains this three set that means when we intersect these two sets that means when we intersect a prime intersection b prime b we will arise what 0 and x minus 1 that means a prime intersection b contains only the element 0 and b minus 1 because b contains this four element and a con a prime contains this three element between these three element and this four element we will only consider these two as common 0 and x minus 1 so the number of element of a prime intersection b will be the addition of 0 and x plus sorry x minus 1 so write it down from the figure from the figure we can write down from the figure number of element of a prime intersection b that's equal to 0 plus x minus 1 now 0 plus x minus 1 equal to x minus 1 now we can find out we can find out easily the number of element of a prime intersection b how the value of x we know value of x equal to 8 minus 1 is here we can write down the note also therefore x equal to 8 from 1 okay f from 1 now 8 minus 1 equal to nothing but 7 my dear students so our number of element of a intersection sorry a prime intersection b number of element of a prime intersection b equal to nothing but 7 my dear students now i am going to solve question number uh, 19 activity 3 activity 3 is find the value of number of element of a intersection b intersection c prime my dear students it is very important we have three sets now a intersection b and intersection c prime to solve this one i am going to erase the activity 2 and we will solve inshallah the activity 3 look very carefully at first the figure okay at first look very very careful with the figure we can write down look number of element of a intersection b intersection c prime we need to identify first of all my students only look a intersection b which part indicates a intersection b which part in, in the, uh, indicates a intersection b intersection b means the common elements of a and b the common elements of a and b the set a is this one in the left circle in the right circle is 
set B. This one is the set B and this one set A. That means these two element is the common part of A and B. This two element is the common part of A and B. Okay. Of A and B, the common part is what? Is this region. And in this region, we have 3, the element 3. And the element, number of element is X man plus 1. Number of element of 3 here and number of element is x plus 1 is contained in A intersection B. Okay. Now, with the A intersection B, we need to intersect also C complement. My distribution C complement contains what? C complement contains, C complement means C is the upper circle, this one. Okay. And C complement contains these three elements. It's twice x, it's x plus 1 and x minus 1. These three elements contained in C complement, my dear students. So, when we intersect these two, that means when we intersect 3 and x plus 1 with twice x, x plus 1 and x minus 1, we will find out only this one. This portion is the common. That means x plus 1. So, my dear students, number of element of A intersection B intersection C prime will be x plus 1. This portion only. Okay. Now, write it down. Here we can write down from the figure number of element of A intersection B intersection C prime that's equal to what that's equal to only x plus 1 okay my distribution is x plus 1 that's equal to what the value of x is equal to 8 plus 1 you can write down the note therefore x equal to 8 from from 1 okay now we can find out the number of element of A intersection B intersection C complement equal to 9. This is our required solution. Again, I am telling you this one. My distribution is very, very important. Look, first of all, we will do what? We will do A intersection B only. A intersection B is the common portion of A and B. And common portion of A and B has 3 element, number of element of 3 and number of element of x plus 1. These two contained in A intersection B. And we need to intersect with these two the C complement. C complement contains what? C complement C complement means what? Without this four set, this three. C is the upper circle, right? C is this upper circle. That means without this circle, that means the upper circle, that means this outer circle is twice x, x plus 1 and x minus 1. This three disjoint set contained in C complement. Okay. And when we intersect these two sets, we will get only x plus 1. 1 okay we can only get x plus 1 as the element of the uh, number of element of a intersection b intersection c complement okay now my dear students you have also a homework today and your homework number is number 9 your homework number is 9 please mention the homework number in your hw copy and my dear students your homework is exercise from exercise 1.1 you should solve question number 18 only it is in your page number 22, okay, in your hand maintenance book. But students, I think you have understood my today's lecture. Keep practicing more and more at home, okay. See you again, inshallah. Till then, Allah Hafiz.